Hi guys, welcome to the Fight Tonight channel. Mike Tyson fires warning to Gervonta Davis over lightweight rivals. Heavyweight great Mike Tyson aired his views on who is the current face of boxing after several high-profile match-ups of late. The baddest man on the planet gave probes to Gervonta Davis after his win over Ryan Garcia. Tyson now sees Tank and Garcia as the leaders of the pack. Mike Tyson faces in boxing. He is truly right. He is the face of boxing, Tyson said. But that's because Ryan Garcia is the draw. And that makes Garcia the face of boxing because of the number of people that he fills in an arena. Signs that fights Ryan Garcia fans will turn into Tank's fans. Davis will have the biggest drawing power, I believe. Ryan brought those people out. Normally, when the draw gets beaten, like Ryan, when he gets beaten, the people that are his fans are now Tank's fans. After stopping Garcia, Davis said the moment culminated all his hard work. Gervonta Davis This is a fight I've wanted for a long time. To be a champion, you have to beat the best. It's not about the titles, it's about who you beat. But it's a testimony to my respect for Gervonta as a fighter. I want to be the best. During this wild journey, I put boxing first and the fans first. I had to accept a lot of stipulations, but my power comes from within and from above. My strength comes from my heart. Tyson says Davies can remain undefeated his entire career after selling over 1 million pay-per-views alongside Garcia. Pound for pound stars. However, Tyson knows there is some natural talent at 135 to 140 pounds that Davies will have to throw down with eventually. It's a great possibility that Tank Davies could go undefeated his world career. But then you've got Devin Haney and Shakur Stevenson, he pointed out. Those guys are very good. Those are the only two guys who are possibly a treat to him. I know they've boxed before, and some people got the advantage over others in sparring. But sparring's not like fighting. For some reason, people don't fight as hard as they spar or train as hard as they fight. It's just a strange dynamic in that. The cold hard fact is that Davies is the world's third best lightweight behind Haney and Stevenson. He has to beat either or both to become the pound-for-pound -pound king moving forward, Mike Tyson said. UFC star Sean Murley offers to fight Gervonta Davies and Ryan Garcia in a boxing ring. UFC star Sean Murley is one of the brightest prospects on Dana White's roster and is planning to also grow his name in the boxing world, where he is eyeing future fights against Gervonta Davies and Ryan Garcia. UFC star Sean Murley is eyeing future crossover boxing fight against Gervonta Davies and Ryan Garcia. Murley is asserting his name in the Batman Way division, where he is currently on course to land a title shot against champion Aljamain Sterling this year. While making his name inside the cage, the American has become one of the most high-profile names on the roster earning comparisons with Conor McGregor. His powerful striking has seen him earn some BKO wins during his rise and seeing him linked with a potential future move to the boxing ring. And in a surprise double callout, I only believe that he has what it takes to beat boxing stars Garcia and Davies, who recently settled their bitter rivalry. Ryan Garcia and Gervonta Davies, those are two guys I could see myself potentially boxing in 5-6 years. He said when discussing a potential future in the squared circle during an interview with GQ Sports, I truly believe I could beat one of those guys. Davis recently stopped Garcia in their huge showdown, which saw the later unable to beat the count after being dropped by a Wii Show's body shot. Overall, the event was a huge success, with many reports suggesting that around 1 million pay per view and you were shift with both fighters also drawing a record gate. 
the winner is now considered one of the faces of the modern era of boxing alongside Canelo Alvarez and the world host of uh, Happyweight Stars. Amelie joins UFC featherweight contenders Max Holloway in calling out heavies with blasted, suggesting that a crossover boat could mirror McGregor's showdown with boxing legend Floyd Mayweather in 2017. It is likely Tang will continue his road towards the world title at lightweight and is likely to be thrust into a title challenge against the winner of Devin Haney's clash this month. There could also be a potential weight switch on the cards for Davies, who could elect to move up and fight the likes of George Taylor or Tefimo Lopez. However, it appears Davies will wait for the winner of the undisputed fight before taking any decision on his next move. I'm not worrying about Haney, Davies said. He needs to focus on May the 20s. We holler at him after. I don't really want to speak on him. This is my moment. We are just going back to the drawing board with my team and everything. And we sit down and make a decision as a team. You know what I mean. Can't really see right now because I just fought. But I'm gonna try and rest. I fought twice in three and a half months. I'm going to try and rest and hopefully we'll come up with a good game plan in the next couple months and get it on again. Thanks for watching guys, if you like this video, please subscribe to my YouTube channel.